guys, welcome back. I'm going to do a complete review on this lipstick doodad mob doodad bob the Kat Von D Spellbinding Lipstick Set. And what I'm going to do is try on all the lipsticks for you so you guys can see what they look like on a human being. Hello, live swatches. I love these kinds of videos and I think it's so much easier to be able to gauge what a color looks like than just hand swatches. So this is the kit right here. This is the Spellbinding Lipstick Set by Kat Von D. It retails for $39. US It comes with 10 little lipsticks, little tiny, teeny tiny lipsticks. I actually already have the first one on. This is the color Bachelorette. This is a really great blend of like a dark fuchsia and it has some reddish undertones. Now contrasting with my hair it really does look red but I assure you in person it's like a dark fuchsia. It's really really beautiful. I love this color. The formula is nice and creamy and it's super easy to put on. So this is Bachelorette, the first color I'm going to try for you guys. This is a labor of love, people, just so you know. I have to clean my lips ten times. This is going to be fun. Okay, so the second color I've tried on you, uh, tried on you, and the second color I've tried on for you is called Ritual. It's a beautiful light mauve nude a light mauve nude. I think you guys can kind of see it on my lips. It's really beautiful. It's definitely that same creamy texture. It's a really great neutral color, especially when you guys are wearing a nice dramatic eye. This is a great color when you don't want to go completely nude. And it's a great your lips but better color. So this is Ritual. This next color is called Lovecraft. Now this is very similar to Ritual where it's kind of a nude, but this has more of a pink base than a brown base. And this is a really, really great nude color. It's a little bit more matte than the last two colors that I tried on. I think this color is super, super beautiful. Again, it's a great nude color. Yeah, it's so beautiful. It's another great gem in this, in this whole scheme of things. It's really pretty. Oh yeah, love spell. Okay, so this next color that I've tried on is called Backstage Bambi. And wow, is this a pink, pink, pink. This is like straight up crazy Barbie pink. It is so bright. It looks absolutely beautiful on your lips, but beware for the dry lips, ladies. It looks like a slightly satin finish, but it feels like a matte lipstick, and it's very chalky going on. But the color looks absolutely beautiful on, so Backstage Bambi is so beautiful. Yeah, I love this color. Ugh. Oh, God help me. God help me. Okay, so this color is called a go-go. Can you tell I don't like it? It is bright friggin' orange. Like this is tangerine amped up on like speed. Hello, bright, bright orange. <sighs> I can't even stand it. It actually, <sighs> I'm like having anxiety just looking at it. Oh my God, help me. So this is a go-go. No doubt it is a beautiful, beautiful, vibrant orange and it will look right on the, on the correct person with the perfect <laughs> white teeth and not pink hair, but for me, this is just a hot mess. You guys have to tell me what you think of this orange on me. I think it's kind of crazy. I do think it's a beautiful lipstick. It's just not right for me and my skin. So, but this is a go-go. Honestly, these, these lipsticks remind me of Lime Crime lipsticks. They're so friggin' pigmented. Okay, so this next color, this lovely purple, and this is called Love, as in L-U-V. Now this is a new addition to the Kat Von D lipstick, lipstick collection. Actually, along with Bachelorette, the first color I tried on or actually is also a never seen, a never before seen color, along with this one, L-U-V. I think it's really, really pretty. Wow, pigment. Ooh, right purple is right. It's really whew, purple. Wow, love it. You guys have no idea how hard it is to put this many lipsticks on with no lip liner. Wow. Okay, so this is the next little itty bitty lipstick. This color is called M U M A U 5. So it's Mo 5, Mao 5. I don't know. This is another new addition to their lipstick line. This is a never, never before seen color. This is so beautiful. This is like a really, really pinky version like I can't even explain it it's more of a fuchsia it's a mix between like a fuchsia and a, it's like it's like if girl about town and rebel had a baby it would be this color I really don't know how else to explain it it's kind of purpley kind of plummy it's beautiful 
really this is this is one of my favorite colors in the line so far yeah so beautiful holy mackerel andy is this a dark lipstick okay so this is called vampira 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 this color is unbelievably gorgeous unbelievably gorgeous wow it's this ugh. okay oh look i made it crooked it was bound to happen eventually, where I screwed up the lipstick. How could I not? Vampira. Yeah, Vampira. This is beautiful. This is a just a dark, burgundy, blood red. Yeah, I like this color. This is a great fall color. Wow. Wow. And this is another never before seen color. Yeah, they hit the jackpot on this color. This is gorgeous. Wow. Beautiful. Really beautiful. This is called Thin Lizzie. I don't know why I keep showing it to you this because you can barely even see it here. Now I'm wearing Thin Lizzie. Now Thin Lizzie, it looks metallic. It's got this metallic finish. It almost has like very fine like glitter in it. So I think the glitter is what gives it that metallic finish. It is really, really beautiful. It's almost like a coppery, rusty, reddish brick red. It's pretty. It's. I think you would have to be the right person to wear it. I don't. I think I'm going to get the least amount of wear out of this lipstick. It's not really my style. It's pretty. Maybe at nighttime, but not during the day. But it's a really, really pretty color. Another never before seen color. All right. So this is the last color in the collection. Now this color is called underage red now this is such a crazy bright red I think this is just such a true nice blue based red it's so beautiful I really really love this it it really it's just so vintage looking and I feel like this is the kind of color that you'd always see Kat Von D wear it's just this beautiful red and it just has this great shine and I I really really love this color vintage red it's it's one of my favorites so beautiful there are so many gorgeous shades in this in this whole package there were only really two shades that I was, wasn't crazy about now I absolutely love the orange shade but I just can't wear it it's just not for me and the last one that I tried on Thin Lizzy with the metallic -y finish I don't uh, it's not really my favorite either but every other color was beautiful there's really a lot of product in each lipstick each lipstick has 1.2 grams in it so it's really not such a bad size product and you times it by 10 you're talking what over 10 grams of products of lipstick one thing I wanted to say before I forget one thing negative about these lipsticks is when you're applying them you can't hold them by the base you have to kind of put your fingers on the silver part silver part because when you go to put them on they like see they just retract into the lipstick tube, which I find a little annoying, but I wanted to make sure I told you guys about that because I kept thinking it every time I applied a lipstick. I'm like, ooh, this is annoying. Oh, oh, it keeps going in. So you have to hold it. So that is one thing to keep in mind about the packaging. So you have to kind of be careful. And other than that, super cute. And I really, really love it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys get this bundle of delicious lipsticks, comment below. Tell me what you think of what your favorite color is. And please tell me what you think your favorite color on me is. Because I'm very, very curious as to what you guys say. I know what I think of the lipsticks, but I'm really dying to know what you guys think of them on me you know which colors because we all have ideas of what things look like on ourselves so tell me I'm really curious to know but if you like this video go ahead give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next video bye guys